Hello everyone, I'm Thomas and welcome to the Island of Soldor, an island where engines like me run on and make sure to get the jobs done like really useful engines should do. Remember the story about an engine named Diesel came to Soldor but made up lies about Doug and was sent away? Well, sometime after that, Diesel was the only engine available to help with the busy harbor but caused some confusion and delay while he was there. This is how it happened. <coughs> Doc and Percy enjoyed working at the harbor very much, but ships kept coming in with cargo for them to push and pull around to the point they got exhausted. So the Fat Controller promised them he'll find another engine to help around. It's about time, said Percy. I ache so much I can hardly get my wheels to move, a great duck, but little did they know, the help they were going to get was very unexpected. There, rolled up beside them, was Diesel with his devious smile. What are you doing here? gasped Duck. Your worthy Sir Topham had sent me. I hope you are pleased to see me. I have to shunt some dreadfully troublesome trucks, and with that, he shunted some trucks quite hard just to make himself clear. However, Duck and Percy didn't trust Diesel one bit, because they were horrified by what he might cause. So they decided to go on strike and refused to leave their shed. It didn't take long for the strike to cause trouble at the harbor. Cargo laid all over the quay and ships full of passengers were delayed. Everyone was complaining about the railway and the back controller had to see the commotion. He asked Duck and Percy what was even going on. We're on strike, sir, said Percy. Yes, added Duck. Big pardon, sir, but we won't work with Diesel. You said you sent him packing, sir. The back controller explained he had to give him a second chance and wanted him to help them with the harbor. Now you must help me. He was the only engine available. So Duck and Percy had no choice but to do what they were told and sadly went back to work. As the days passed, Diesel was making messes by shunning and biffing the trucks too hard. What would the Fat Controller say? asked Percy to Duck. He won't like it, answered Duck, but Diesel heard what they said and was calling them tattletales for having ideas to tell on him. That made Duck and Percy stop for having any more ideas. But it didn't stop Diesel from causing more trouble. The next day came, and Diesel was pushing trucks full of china clay, and wasn't paying attention to where he was going. He pushed them to the buffers that weren't secured, and they sank into the sea. Later that night, the trucks were hoisted from boats and cranes while the back controller was cross with Diesel and spoke severely to him. Things were better here before you arrived. I shall not invite you back. Then he asked Duck and Percy if they don't mind handling the work by themselves. They immediately answered, no sir, and immediately went to work while Diesel oiled away. <coughs> And that was the story of how Diesel's return didn't go smoothly as planned and was sent away for the second time. Just remember to be careful who you're working with and never hesitate to tell if the person is causing trouble at your job. I better get back to work so I can continue being a really useful engine on this railway. Come back again and I'll tell you another story that happened here on this island. See you soon!